This is exam one, problem one solution. Um, here we have a circuit with several capacitors in it and we're going to determine the total capacitance. Well, the first two um, are in series and so capacitors in series all right, add inversely. All right, so the formula we need is this one, where the capacitors in series add inversely. So what we're looking at is 1 over 0.3 microfarads plus 1 over 10 microfarads uh, microfarads equals 1 over the capacitance we're after. All right? So I'm going to pop over to Excel. We've got 0.3 microfarads, we've got 10 microfarads, and 1 over, hmm, 1 over 3.3 microfarads, 1 over 10 microfarads. Now we have to add that up, right? And then that is 3.433, right? is 1 over the capacitance of that side. 1 over the capacitance is, get into math mode, 1 over the capacitance is 3.433 per, and this is per microfarad, because we've been using microfarads the whole time. And so now we have to invert that, so 1 divided by that, right, gives us 0.29 microfarads. So the capacitance we're after is 0.29 microfarads. That's for side um, for these two right there, right? That ends up being that. Now we've got if you imagine it, right, if we were to redraw it, now we have our um, 0.29 microfarads in parallel with 2.5, right? 2.5, 0.29, right? So capacitors in parallel add directly. So this, the total capacitance we're after is just going to be 0.29 microfarads plus 2.5 microfarads. Right? And that's going to be 2.79 microfarads. Right? 2.9, 2.5, 0.29 and 2.5. So if I came back here and I said 2.5 micro, the other five, the one that actually is a five, 2.5 microfarads, and now I sum these up, the 0.29, 2.5. I've got 2.79 microfarads, and that is the solution to problem one.